Good evening and welcome to the special episode of the Buck Stops here. I'm Barkha Dutt. Uttar Pradesh is an election that is going to decide what happens next in New Delhi. It's an election in which Congress General Secretary Rahul Gandhi has staked his all, even though his sister Priyanka Gandhi says this is not a make or break election for him. On the program today, we'll be taking a close look at the Priyanka Gandhi factor. From the ground in Amethi and Raibareli, we follow Priyanka Gandhi on the election trail. We look at why she gets the kind of media attention she does and whether she will be an element that will have an impact on UP's electoral results. Come election time and a cavalcade of cars and cameras will invariably head from Lucknow to Amethi. Past the mustard fields and the Mufassal towns, navigating the rickety roads and the clouds of dust. To arrive at the family bastion of the Gandhi family. From Sanjay Gandhi to his brother Rajiv, from Sonia Gandhi to her son Rahul, Amethi has been synonymous with the Gandhis for decades. But the clamour of the cameras in election season is for someone who has never contested an election and according to her, never will. In a high stakes election for her brother, this time the buzz is all about whether Priyanka Gandhi will go beyond the family belt of Sultanpur, Rai Bareilly and Amethi, where the Congress grabbed seven of the ten assembly segments in 2007. Will she don warrior mantle in the larger battleground of UP this time? The election has been pitched as an all or nothing bout for her brother. But her campaign speeches are understated on hyperbole, focusing instead on what she calls the need for change. In the past 22 years, the rest of the country has grown up. The rest of the country has grown up. Annoyed by her ability to get consistent and insistent media coverage, despite the fact that she is an erratic presence in the state, the opposition has taunted her for being a parachuter, a seasonal visitor, as opposed to a committed insider. जब बरसाती मेंढक की बात की गई है, तो निश्चित तौर से चुनाव चुनाव अगर कोई व्यक्ति अपनी गतिविधियां करता है, तो निश्चित तौर से वो बरसाती मेंढक है। उत्तर प्रदेश में फुल टाइम फुल टाइमर पॉलिटिकल और सोशल वर्कर चाहिए, ना कि होल टाइमर की आए और पिकनिक की और चले गए। But unfazed, she has taunted them right back, with the phrase "Barsati Mendak" now becoming a new entrant in Uttar Pradesh's political lexicon. मैं हूँ बरसाती में इंडक लेकिन राहुल नहीं है मैं चुनाव के लिए आती हूँ बिल्कुल सही कि इसमें नकारने की क्या बात है सबको मालूम है मैं चुनाव के संचालन के लिए आती हूँ इसमें कुछ छुपाने की बात तो है नहीं आपके बच्चों के अभिषेक की बात Most of Priyanka Gandhi's speeches have a singular theme, imploring the voters to make a change. Her now trademark political style is well chronicled on camera. The brisk walk reminiscent of her grandmother. The earthy embrace that is her very own. And the walking straight into a crowd of people mingling with them freely. She is easily the most gregarious member of her otherwise media shy and media averse family. And ironically, the one person who is not in politics. <laughs> prompting many foreign journalists to wonder why she gets the media attention she does. Andrew Buncombe of The Independent asked on Twitter, what does it say about Indian democracy that unelected Priyanka's UP campaign is front page news? So why is Priyanka Gandhi often the media's favorite story? 
Everyone is fascinated with every member of the Gandhi family. Then there's the question which used to be asked about uh, Priyanka. Uh, will she be the one who comes forward to lead the Congress party or will it be Rahul? But now that we've answered that question, apparently there is still a lot of doubt in people's minds. Um, people are always asking when or whether Priyanka will come into politics. But there's also uh, the personal qualities of Priyanka. She is, and I've seen it with my own eyes, an extremely good campaigner. She has a very sympathetic way with crowds. She's very good at dealing with them. And of course also, there is a certain physical resemblance between her and Indra Gandhi. <laughs> hours of her campaign as day turns to night wherever she goes there's a camera lurking somewhere even when her car drops off the main road and weaves its way into the kacha gullies of the interior villages to hold corner side meetings like this one there is a relentless curiosity about her behind me priyanka gandhi in the middle of a road show stopping every few kilometers to meet people door to door. Rahul Gandhi's UP formula worked for the Congress in the Lok Sabha elections. Now the big question is, can the formula replicate itself in the assembly elections? But one thing's for sure, given how much Rahul Gandhi has personally invested in this campaign, whatever happens, victory, defeat or an improvement will be associated with him. No wonder that Priyanka, who you see right behind me, mentions Rahul in every election speech. Priyanka Gandhi! Priyanka Gandhi! Priyanka Gandhi! Priyanka Gandhi! As she clocks 56 such stops in a single day, many believe that the fact that Priyanka Gandhi has stayed out of active electoral politics has in fact proved to be her advantage. If she comes in politics and Rahul is there and Sonia Gandhi is there, there is going to be some problem, is there going to be power center, there, there will be, you know, there are a lot of congressmen have a tradition of uh, sacrifice and anger on, so they will, there could be some kind of conflict and I think so, uh, Priyanka Gandhi understands all this very well and therefore she is there just around, she is just uh, backing Rahul Gandhi to the hilt and uh, I think lot will depend upon the outcome of Uttar Pradesh election that will tell the course of uh, Rahul Gandhi's future. Until Priyanka Gandhi campaigns outside the family belt in Uttar Pradesh, her direct impact as a political force still remains statistically untested. But with an undisputed charisma, wherever she goes, a camera may never be too far behind. A buck stops here, special report. NDTV's cricket app, Android and iPhone. Faster scorecard, special analysis, and much more. Download free. NDTV.com slash apps.